What is good? Diamond Dynasty, Steve, baby. Y'all already know what's going on in this video today. Today, man, as you guys can tell by the title of this video, what we're going to be reacting to today, man. I want to shout out to The Truth Is. Link will be at the top of the description if you guys want to go subscribe to his channel. Always dropping some dope videos on content just like this make sure that you guys like comment subscribe all of that tell a friend to tell a friend today ain't your mama today uncle joey still a hoe let's get right into the video man let's get it doja cat is currently one of the biggest female artists out now she has dropped <clears throat> a few massive hit songs that have been able to rake in huge streaming numbers she is hands down one of the most successful female artists in the last few years you would think that with all this success doja cat would be at her happiest living her dreams and enjoying the perks of being a superstar but if you look at her it appears that that's not the case is that look her that's her y'all wow instagram versus reality anyway looking at doja cat today leaves you with the question what really happened to doja cat has she lost her mind is she using substances does she not want to be famous anymore those are the few questions her own fans seem to have what happened to the doja cat that first came into the industry the one that sang the song about being a cow taking one good look at doja today you will quickly notice that the old doja cat is dead and gone mm. this was a transformation that was set to happen mm. the mk ultra that's what it looked like right here yo um <clears throat> sex kitten programming or something like that Omen doja signed that dotted line on her record contract many people including her fans are starting to believe she sold their soul to become <clears> a star <throat> and her actions are a result of that very deal and how can you blame them doja has been making it pretty obvious for some time now all of this seems to have started last year when out of nowhere <clears throat> doja held a live stream where she shaved off her head this was strange but it got even she was on some britney spears type shit man and she a pretty girl. She's a pretty girl, naturally pretty and all of that, you know? I was just surprised it went from hair to no hair that quick. I don't know what the fuck is going on here? When she was shaving her head, she proceeded to shave her eyebrows I was about to say, well. she draws point, them shits on. fans thought it was weird, but after Doja explained it off by saying she was tired of having her hair, fans let it go mm -hmm. and continued to support her. After this, Doja started acting strange, which made her fans even more concerned. Her strange behavior continued when she was seen at a red carpet event being interviewed. During the red carpet event, Doja appeared off and loopy. She also had some strange makeup done, which appeared like bruising. During the interview, before Doja could even finish talking to the person interviewing her, she was pulled away by her team. Mm. Good. What's your name and where are you from? My name's Amala and I am from California. Okay, Cali's definitely in the house. I'll play with her. See you look. Can you describe it for us today? So this is uh, head to toe Balenciaga. I have uh, Pen Canessi okay. as the jewelry. And okay. then I don't know. Brett, Brett would know. Okay. Uh, I have uh, parts of four on my hand. Damn, staring her down. Like, uh, let, let's make sure that we keep tabs on her. And uh -huh. then Balenciaga. <coughs> oh my God, amazing, amazing. <laughs> And then for my grills, I had alligator Jesus do uh, fangs, but one fell out. Okay, stop playing with her. If you give anybody a styling tip, what would it be? Um, <clears throat> have fun. I'm boring. Okay. I don't know. Oh, that's fine. What's your favorite meal? <laughs> Sorry? What's your favorite meal? Lobster. Ooh, and what's your zodiac sign? Okay, we got favorite what? Your zodiac sign. Libra. Right, Libra, thank you so much. They already know. Her shit glitching. Her shit is glitching the fuck out, boy. <laughs> <clears throat> and I think they pulled her away because they know, like, we don't want her to say anything weird. We don't want her to be off in any type of way to where people will question who the fuck this really is. Lobster. Ooh, and what's <clears throat> yes, okay, okay, we got a favorite what? Yes, so yes, her eyes are going crazy. Libra. Right, Libra, thank you so much for your time. This seemed extremely strange, mm -hmm. and I covered this Them when it eyes. first happened. To me, it looked rather strange that her team was controlling her that way. They pulled her away as if they didn't want her to say something she wasn't supposed mm -hmm. to. In my opinion, I previously had stated that those pulling on Doja appeared to be her handlers. Mm -hmm. Doja kept on her strange I antics, agree. but it got even weirder when her birthday came around. Doja threw what she called what an fuck? eyes wide shut themed birthday party. Weird. She showed up to her party dressed like the woman that was sacrificed in the movie Eyes Wide Shut mm. and also had a Freemason themed birthday cake. Mm. On the cake, she featured the Masonic square and mm -hmm. compass symbol and also the Masonic all seeing mm -hmm. eye. All the big name celebrities <coughs> attended her party where photos were even leaked of Doja with her top missing at her party. <laughs> her this party missing. was an obvious ritual party where the celebrities came together and did God knows what. When the fans saw this party, they lost their minds, and that's when the Illuminati accusations began. They all started accusing Doja of selling her soul, and Doja didn't like this. 
This is when Doja began to mock her own fans who were now becoming worried about her. Doja went online and started trolling those who thought she sold out. She would make videos calling them dumb and telling them they were crazy for thinking that. And that's what they all say, y'all. They don't want you to believe that this shit is really real. And they always try to make light of the situation. They always try to laugh about it and bring humor to it. They always want to shame people who actually believe this stuff. This While showing more and more demonic imagery as time went by, she would post photos of her dressed as the devil on her Instagram page. She would also get demonic tattoos on herself several times. She got this demon tattooed on her arm that she defended by calling it now damn that is ugly as shit bro like you couldn't pick a better demon than that art she also got this baphomet tattooed on her wrist and she also got this demonic creature on her back she was also featured on the day's magazine cover looking demonic she also went dressed to an art show in red crystals head to toe calling the outfit doja's inferno it was becoming more and more clear that the old looks like a blood ritual to me yo doja was gone and now the world was being introduced to a new doja clone cat, one that openly shows <coughs> who she truly serves recently doja has confirmed that the old doja is gone and she has been reborn about two weeks ago Doja Cat tweeted some very interesting tweets. She tweeted, let myself heal, scars finally sealed. She also tweeted out the number six. This caught my attention and I knew it was going to reveal itself very soon. On her Instagram one week before this, she was posting coded messages like this one where she captioned it Scarlet written backwards. The post was what seemed to be a moon while someone is whispering in the back Scarlet. This was strange, and to me, the moon imagery pointed to moon magic. Occultists often show moon imagery to refer to moon magic, which is sometimes associated with a rebirth ritual. We saw this imagery in the video for Latin artist Carol G, where the moon is shown in the video, and then she is shown covered in blood, representing her rebirth. Not long after Doja posted that video, she posted this photo which just appears to be Doja wearing jewelry with her face shadowed out of the picture. But when you take this photo and adjust the brightness, you can see that it's actually Doja make- My bad, yo. I smacked the fuck out of that fruit fly. I oh, I killed that. I killed your motherfucking ass, bitch. Killed your motherfucking ass. Tell your friends about me, ho. So stupid ass. The moon imagery pointed to moon magic. Occultists often show moon imagery to refer to moon magic, which is sometimes associated with a rebirth ritual. We saw this imagery in the video for Latin artist Carol G, where the moon is shown in the video and then she is shown covered in blood, representing her rebirth. Not long after Doja posted that video, she posted this photo, which just appears to be Doja wearing jewelry with her face shadowed out of the picture. But when you take this photo and adjust the brightness, you can see that it's actually no. Doja making a demonic face with what appears to be blood pouring out of her mouth. When I saw this, I started asking myself, why is Doja showing this imagery? That's a demon, Things were man. starting to add up to me, especially after seeing the next post. I be feeling like, man, their soul is gone and a demon comes. You know, the demon is being channeled through the, uh, the body. The post right after this was an image of what appears to be Doja's upcoming album, which shows Doja clothless covered Let's in begin. blood. This photo is an obvious representation of Doja Cat's rebirth. The post was captioned, let's begin, with a drop of blood this emotion. Shit is creepy. After this, Doja dropped her new song and music video called Detention. In the video, she shows herself once again covered in blood, staring into the screen. Fucking this weird. was Doja showing the world she had been reborn. What's interesting is that Doja went on IG Live explaining the song. She described the song as not being a song really, but a message. So the, so, attention is not, well, I look like a question mark, I need to, I need to sit normal. I, so, attention is not really a song, it's like more of like a piece, it's a oh. message, a it's not really supposed to be replayed, but I thought it would be a nice thing to start off the whole rollout with, with that kind of thing, I wouldn't even replay attention if <laughs> I heard it. What? I, I, I would just appreciate it for what it is. What does that um, even mean, ma'am? <laughs> it's kind of, 
wish. It's more of a message and less of a, I don't even know it. Because I'm, I'm commanding you to listen to what I'm saying on the song. Commanding you to listen, y'all. Y'all heard that? And she said she wouldn't even give it a second listen. I'm demanding. Way to promote your shit. I'm, I'm commanding you to listen to what I'm saying on the song. I'm demanding it Bruh. here. As you heard for yourself, she called the song a message, and the message is about her rebirth. She was building up for this moment since last year. She was going through her death and rebirth right in front of the world, and everybody saw it. Right around the time she released this music video, she tweeted that Scarlett was here, again spelled backwards, announcing her rebirth, letting the world know Scarlett was now in charge. Now, not long the after demon. this, she stated she was going on tour, and that she was going to call her tour Scarlett. Her tour's flyer shows her covered in blood, which we now know represents Scarlet, and means that it will be Scarlet performing at these shows. Mm -hmm. Five days ago, she posted this on Instagram, which shows her once again looking demonic. It's obvious Doja wants her fans to know she is no longer in control. Mm -hmm. Just like we saw with Beyonce and Nicki Minaj, weird. Doja Cat is now reborn with her new alter ego. All of this satanic imagery was pointing to this very moment. She called everyone crazy that called her out for selling her soul. All while she made it more and more obvious that that's that what she, she did. did. Mm -hmm. Doja Cat, like the rest of the female stars, took the Masonic oath. She is serving the Masonic agenda, pushing the do it that will ideology to her fans. Doja looks nothing like she did when she first got in the industry. She wanted it all so bad, she was willing to do whatever they said. Now she is posting photos like these, where she is trying to look like a demon. Her lust for fame made her sacrifice herself. Her song Attention was supposed to represent a notification of her new transformation. Doja doesn't have to ever admit she sold their soul out of her own mouth. You can see it from her actions. Mm -hmm. We must remember what purpose these artists play to guide us away from God. Y'all let me know how y'all feel in the comment section down below, man. Doja Cat is definitely gone. All right, if you cannot see that, you're blind. All right, let me know how y'all feel in the comment section down below. Make sure that you guys like, comment, subscribe, all of that. Tell a friend and tell a friend and tell they ain't your mama, tell they uncle Joey still hall. We'll see you guys in the next motherfucking video. And I love y'all, man. Peace. We out, baby.